Yeah. Um, so I picked up a lot of new stuff, and I, if you guys don't mind, I'll do another one. Yeah. Oh! This is cool. Yeah. So this is just, great. This is a known freak out. This is fake. Fake gun. Fake All right. gun. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. And what's the scenario here? You're, uh... uh. Yeah, like I'm like going after a perp. <laughs> and then I do this move. Okay, ready? Yeah. Here we go. That was incredible. Dope, right? <laughs> Very nicely done. <sighs> so, you know, just like cop stuff. Sure. <laughs> you gained a lot of weight the minute you yeah. went back there. <laughs> yeah. Just saying. Went back there. Pounded like three forties, ate a bunch of donuts. <laughs> That's what happened. Got lit on fire, came back out here and finished out. <laughs> it burned the fat right off of you. Yeah. That was great. Smoke, yeah. was, smoke was just coming out of your pocket. Yeah, for no reason. <laughs> uh, season four of Brooklyn Nine-Nine <laughs> premieres tomorrow night at eight on Fox and Storks is in theaters on Friday. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. What? Yeah. We're just getting sony, man. <laughs> Talk about a hot pocket. <laughs> you got to present. I did. With Kit Harrington. Kit Harrington. Ladies. Yeah. Ladies love that Kit Harrington. Ladies love Kit Harrington. Also known as Jon Snow. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That really threw him for. A... <laughs> wow, you're wow. you're unnecessarily smug about yeah, that. A little piece of smug it. about it. <laughs> <laughs> you're the only guy that knows. Uh, and so uh, that must have been fun to work with him last night because you guys have worked together before. We have, yeah. We did a, uh, a tennis mockumentary called really, Seven Days in Hell. For really funny. Yeah. Thank you. Um, but I learned, like, it's a little bit dangerous to work with people from Game of Thrones because when you're in their sphere, I'm a huge fan of Game of Thrones. Yeah, me too. And I don't want spoilers. But I had a really major one kind of blown for me because I was working with Kit. Because you're working with Kit on the mockumentary? Yeah, because yeah, we got, like, a, an email from the PR people at HBO, and they were like, hey, great news. We're going to run the first commercial for Seven Days in Hell after the Game of Thrones finale, and there's going to be tons of excitement around it because Jon Snow dies. <laughs> and I was just like, no! <laughs> you know, like, there's... When you, like, go on the wrong site or something, you get a spoiler, and you, yeah. it's like a new phenomenon, but it's like slow motion of trying to look away, but you already saw it. It's like, <laughs> it's like seared into your brain. Yeah. And I was like, oh, I guess I'll watch the finale now. Yeah. And even better than Olympic athletes, Luke Skywalker himself, Mark Hamill, yeah. repeatedly tweets about how much he loves your show. Do you know Mark Hamill? I actually have met Mark Hamill. I mean, everyone on our show freaked out when he started doing that. I bet. Um, I met him because we produced this movie that Kyle Mooney and, and his buddies did called Brigsby Bear, and Mark Hamill was in it. Okay. And uh, I was in Salt Lake City sort of crossing paths right as Mark Hamill was coming in to shoot his stuff. Uh -huh. And we're like, oh, we should all go out and get beers and some food and just hang out and chat. And at first, you're like, oh, my God, it's Mark Hamill. But he's such a nice guy. We, like, went to this big bar. It was pretty empty. We went to the back and just had some beers and chatted. And after about five minutes, he's so sweet and disarming. You're just like, oh, that's me and Mark. Just hanging out, you know? Yeah. And then we were like, all right, well, good to meet you. And we got up to leave, and it was a little later in the night, and the bar had filled in a little. And as soon as we stepped, like, back into the main bar area, it was like, Luke! <laughs> Luke Skywalker! Luke, I'm your father! Luke! <laughs> Holy 
it's Luke Skywalker. You know, like, oh my God! Oh, this guy's life is a nightmare. <laughs> I'm excited. You know, uh, another th cool thing about turning 40. I'm gonna start knocking things off my bucket list, I think. Oh, that's a good idea. A lot of people yeah. do that. What's, what's on your bucket list, for example? Uh, well, I only have two things at this point. For the, the first one is uh, I wanna jack off on the roof of a building like Leonardo DiCaprio in Basketball Diaries. <laughs> Which, okay. I know what you're all thinking. Why haven't you done that already? <laughs> and the answer is, because I'm shy. Right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Also, you, it's... Wait till fall with the sun, it's sunscreen, yeah. it's a yeah. problem. Yeah, right? you don't want to do it in the summer. No. Yeah, no. yeah. And then the second thing, I, which I know you want me to say, because I set it up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'll help you. you. You mentioned one of the two. <laughs> What's the second? Oh. <laughs> I want to get swallowed whole by a sea monster, then explode out of one of its eyeballs and yell, Beowulf! <laughs> <laughs> Which, wow, I will confess, is a reference to the movie Beowulf. Uh -huh. It's a motion capture film that came out a few years ago that yeah. I'm a great fan of. Yeah, I think you and two other people love that movie. <laughs> well, that other person's very satisfied with their experience. Because <laughs> it's a treat and a half, and I highly recommend it. All right. Yeah. Uh, now, speaking of movies that people want to see, Hotel Transylvania 3, yes. Summer Vacation. Yes. We have a clip here. Anything you want to do to set this up? No, uh, I think it probably just speaks for itself. Yeah. All right, yeah. well, let's take a look at this clip. Uh, Hotel Transylvania 3, Summer Vacation. Yeah. Explain to me who yell. Why does he yell his own name? It's a running theme throughout the movie. That is not the only time he does it. When I do something cool, I don't yell Conan. It just doesn't make it. But maybe you should. Maybe I should. By the way, it's a good thing they didn't show the basketball diaries clip. <laughs> <laughs> but we're very happy to be back. And just now, on it all. You know what's so nice is uh, you're stay Fox announces they're not picking up your show. And that happens to a lot of shows. It happened to your show. People went nuts. A lot of fans came out in support. Yes. And they were tweeting these very nice things about your show. And some big deal people came out in support of your show. Yes, some really, uh, some, some high-end folks proved to be fans. And it was very helpful to getting the show picked up again. That's Twitter. really nice. You know, we had um, Lin-Manuel Miranda, he yeah. tweeted. What did he tweet? I think we have it, yeah. Yeah, Renew Brooklyn Nine-Nine. I only watched like four things. This is one That's of them. Very that cool was very that nice. That. Yeah. Um, I believe we had uh, Mark Hamill tweeted about the oh, show. That's cool. Yeah. Oh no, Luke. Yeah. So not ready to say bye bye Nine-Nine. That's nine. cool. Um, the Dalai Lama tweeted. Did he tweet? Yeah. There it is. <laughs> Just heard about Brooklyn Nine-Nine. So maybe there is no God. I think we got tweeted about by Manafort. Paul Manafort. Yeah. Bum day ass. <laughs> you know, I was glad. Really? Yeah, and then, uh, and I think Blue, Blue the Velociraptor tweeted about it. <laughs> Squawk, screech, scratch, hashtag Andre Brower is zaddy, which yeah, I agree okay. with. I don't know. <laughs> you have a lot of fans in high places. Yeah, and Brower be zaddy. <laughs> don't know what you're talking about. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> now, is this true? Uh, did, did Adam Sandler show up at your wedding? I invited Sandler to the wedding, and he did come, yeah. Um, I was, of course, very worried about it, because he's one of the biggest stars on Earth. And yeah. I was like, oh, if Sandler comes, everyone in our families is going to hound him, and I don't want him to feel put out. But I also really would love him to come, because we're friendly. Uh, and the night before, I, he told me, he was like, all right, I'll come. I'll be there. Don't worry about it. And the night before, I was uh, getting a drink at the night before party that we had sort of a hangout uh -huh. with the families and stuff. Uh -huh. And all of a sudden, I just uh, I hear Sandler's voice going like, yeah, there, there's my guy right there. <laughs> and I, I look up, and he's dressed as his character from That's My Boy, which is really <laughs> With, like, the wig and a ponytail right, yeah, 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 and, yeah. like, the crappy tie. Right. And I'm like, what is like, it's me, Donnie Burger! <laughs> and I'm like, he fully committed. Fully That's committed. Great. I was like, oh, uh, I can't believe you're doing this. It's so incredible. He's like, oh, am I embarrassing you, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at his knuckleheads getting married, everybody. And I was like, why was I worried about Sandler? <laughs> <laughs>
uh, I've always been curious about something. I know you know what I'm talking about because we worked at SNL. But Lauren Michaels smells fantastic. And there's a thing everyone who works there knows, which is if he's just been in the hallway or if he's just been in the elevator or something, you can smell whatever the smell is that he smells like. like yes. Like Lauren was just here. And it's it a scent. Great. This yeah. is, and this is a, is a very pleasant but uh, hard to define scent. Correct. So I've always wondered what it was. And at that dinner, I was like, man, there's never going to be a better time to ask a group of people because they all know him. Everybody at that table had worked for Lauren. Yes. Yeah. So I was, you know, asked. It's like, hey, anybody know what that thing Lauren uses? What is that? And Mulaney actually was the one who was like, oh, I was curious about that too. I asked someone in his office, it's a deodorant made by Hermes. And I went, oh, that's so cool. I, wouldn't it be so funny if we all got it and then we all smelled like Lauren and freaked everyone out and we all laughed together. We're like, ah, ha, 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 yeah, it'd be right, crazy. Right. Then moved on. Do you remember that? Yeah, I don't remember me laughing, but everyone else was laughing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you were stone cold on it. <laughs> he was probably just eating. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was like, we can, we can <laughs> use this on the talk show. <laughs> At any rate, uh, a few weeks later, Mulaney texts me and he goes, you'll never guess what I just did. I got the Lorne deodorant. <laughs> and I was like, that's funny. So did I. <laughs> you got it too? I also went and got it. And he was like, oh, that's so funny. Uh, my wife, Anna, has been making fun of me because for the first week I was using it without taking the, pla the see-through plastic cap off the top. <laughs> So he was spraying himself and nothing was coming it's like out? A, it's a roll-on. Oh, a roll-on. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. And I was like, ah, ha, ha, you dummy. Wait, what plastic cap? <laughs> <laughs> and I went and checked mine, and it was all, no! <laughs> and my wife was like, you idiot. You were like, it, I feel like I have to put so much of it on to make it work. <laughs> I was like grinding plastic into my armpit. <laughs> you were probably walking around going, smell anything? Yes. Uh, no. So then, uh -huh. a little while after that, we were like, aha, OK, but now we both smell wonderful and we smell like Lauren. Yeah. So then, a while after that, I was chatting with someone who works with Lauren, and I told that story. Mm -hmm. And they were like, oh, that's funny. He doesn't use Hermes. That's not it. Oh, you're kidding. And I was like, what? And they were like, yeah, 100%, that's not it. And I was crushed. And I called John, and I was like, hey, man, it's not the right one. We're not using the Lorne scent. And he was like, what? Then who the hell do we smell like? <laughs> and I said, I think we smell like each other. <laughs> 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 that was it.